Hello everyone, so this is Ashok Krach. So in this video we are going to discuss about what is facility management. Okay, so shortly uh, the people will denote uh, this as FM facility management or IFM integrated facility management like that the people will uh, tell. So generally what is facility management? So if you are asking anybody, so uh, if, if you are asking the same question, if they are asking the question to somebody you now, so they will definitely they will tell that it is it is nothing but uh, they will tell, generally they will tell that everything starting from the uh, from the building to from the clean to from the building uh, 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 infrastructure maintenance till uh, the facility has to take care and the facility management is nothing but they have to manage the facility like that they will tell. So of course there are uh, uh, that is also a correct answer but exactly the facility management is nothing but is the uh, uh, organizational function which integrate the people, place, process uh, within the built environment uh, with uh, in order to improve the uh, what in order to improve the uh, quality of the life of the people and uh, core uh, uh, business okay and uh, and its core business okay improve its core its business so uh, so facility generally the facility management is the uh, backbone of the any organization why because they the, they are the people they are the team has to take care of everything for example if you are taking any IT company so in IT company the people has uh, has to come from uh, their home to till uh, they have to start at, they have to start at, uh, from their home to office so from what uh, department will help transport team will involve they have to uh, pick up the associate they have to drop the associate with their uh, vehicle okay with their own vehicle or they, they, they may uh, give that uh, uh, thing to the third party uh, vendor okay and if, if the associate is entered into the facility, okay, and is, 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 is uh, uh, bordered to the facility, so what will happen? And the separate physical security team has checked everything and uh, whether they have the proper ID card and whether they have the proper uh, thing, everything they will check and they will allow the associate to inside the facility. So after maybe a two layer security system or a three layer security system uh, may be there. So after coming, uh, after reaching their own uh, place no, and they have to do the access so wherever uh, which are the facility, which are the ODCs are they have to access no and they have to uh, definitely they have the access and they have to uh, do the access and they have to reach the that uh, seat okay so their uh, their uh, access management team will come and seat if you are taking the seat and seat management team is also is there and they have to provide the, they have to allocate the uh, proper seat to the associate and the, the seat utilization has to do the, the seat management team. So I am telling how the uh, team is involved. So it all comes under the facility management only. Okay. And after uh, reaching the facility, the light has to turn on and the AC has to turn on and whether the cleaning is properly uh, has to taken care by the team. So soft service team will involve and technical team will involved HVC team uh, will involve doing that uh, uh, thing and uh, once they have position and everything and they have started uh, their work okay and if in case they have any uh, for example if they want to do the uh, connect the uh, uh, meeting with their client and they have to approach the meeting room then the in the meeting room there may be a problem in switching on the TV or the, in order to they may face the connectivity issue so everything the people has to uh, the facility team has to take care and they have to support the uh, 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 occupant okay they are they are occupying the space no they have to support it in order to they have to provide the uh, good environment to the occupant okay so that only the productivity of uh, that uh, uh, thing no and will be improved okay so facility management is the pillar uh, the facility if you are talking in the facility management and four is the main pillar of the facility management one is space uh, place uh, people okay people place process and the technology is the pillar of the facility management and if you are dividing the facility management uh, you, you can also divide the facility management into two categories one is soft facility management services and hard facility management services so hard facility management services if you are talking about it's nothing but it's related to the physical assets and physical space physical space space and assets which it's all about hard facility management services nothing but it's related to the physical uh, 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 physical space and physical assets okay for example HVAC lighting and uh, uh, lighting and uh, uh, electrical so everything is comes under the uh, what hard facility management services 
ओके एंड आल्सो फायर सेफ्टी सिस्टम आल्सो विल कम्स अंडर दी हार्ट फेजिलिटी मैनेजमेंट सर्विसेज एंड इफ यू आर टॉकिंग अबाउट सॉफ्ट फेजिलिटी मैनेजमेंट सर्विसेज एंड इट्स रिलेटेड टू दी ऑर्गेनाइजेशन एंड ऑपरेशन लाइक एडमिनिस्ट्रेट एडमिनिस्ट्रेशन कम्स अंडर दी सॉफ्ट सर्विस सॉफ्ट फेजिलिटी मैनेजमेंट सर्विसेज ओनली एंड आल्सो क्लीनिंग एंड ईएचएस कंप्लाइंस ओके एंड सीट अलोकेशन सीट यूटिलाइजेशन so everything will comes under the soft uh, facility management so i am giving some examples a lot of things will come so even if you are taking the about the uh, what uh, hard uh, facility management services that are lease uh, rent and uh, uh, all the uh, some documents everything will comes under the, these things even budgeting also will comes under the hard facility management services only if you are taking soft service uh, uh, soft facility management services and i already told right so these are the administrative and the hs complaints and everything will come even seat relocation seat seat management team everything will comes under the soft facility management uh, services if you are talking about facility management services we can able to divide it into two and all the two will we, we will cover all the things okay so now you got the what is facility management and uh, what are the types of uh, uh, facility management operations are there so definitely you will able to understand so far so uh, we will discuss one by one what what are the department where are they there and uh, what is the role of the ages manager in the facility management what is the role of facility management the facility manager in the facility management so one by one we will be discussing in upcoming our videos if you want to particularly if you want to uh, discuss about any uh, particular thing no and uh, request you to uh, put uh, your queries in the comment section and we will try to address it okay so that's all today and we will discuss about uh, based on your feedback and based on your response and we will discuss more about facility management and thank you uh, for watching our videos bye